In this tutorial, we will learn how to develop VBA code for adding sheets based on a given list in MS Excel. I have a file here. In this Excel file, I have a list of countries. I want to develop a macro or develop VBA code to add sheet for each country and rename the added sheet with country name. This is the list of countries. So we can see here that I have a command button. When I click on this command button, then we can see that all the sheets are added as well as renamed as per the values or I would say name of countries given in this list. So here we will learn step by step how we can develop using VBA code this kind of a structure to create multiple sheets and renaming those sheets. So first of all, I will open a new Excel file. I am using shortcut control N or anyways we can open a new Excel file. On this Excel file, I have only one sheet. Let me rename this sheet as master sheet. On this sheet, let me increase the width of column and width of all the rows. And here, let me write name of some countries, list of countries, let's say India, Australia, Japan, China, Brazil, Canada. So let's say this is the list and we want to add sheet for each country. Let me increase the font size. So what I will do? I will go to developer tab and then click on insert and from active X control I will drag and drop a small command button so when I click this command button it will take me to VBA editor window where I can write VBA code and that code will be executed once I click on this command button so let's see what is the code that we need for performing this task. So let's start. So first line of code is to check that how many cells are filled in column A. For that code is last cell equal to this workbook dot worksheets. Within worksheets, I will give name of sheet and that is master sheet dot cells and rows dot count column is a that means first dot and xl xl up dot row this will check that what is the last cell filled and then i will write a for loop and that for loop is for i equal to 2 that means from second cell to last cell closing statement of for loop let me increase the window size that is next so within starting and end of for loop i will write some vba code that code will add sheet and rename that sheet to add sheets i have code like with this workbook and here dot sheets dot add then after colon equal to sign dot sheets then dot sheets dot count 
and in next line we can stop this with a statement by using keyword as and with but after adding sheet we need to rename that sheet for that first of all i will refer to cell where we have name of country so a variable that is named as new name equal to this workbook dot worksheets again name of sheet that is master sheet dot cells i comma one dot value so this will store name of country one by one as loop will move forward and once name is there in this variable then here after adding sheet we can write code as active sheet dot name equal to new name this new name is same what we are capturing the name of sheet or values from cells so this is the code that we have written now once loop will work and all the sheets will be added then after next keyword i need to write some more code so that compiler does not stop anywhere so that code is this workbook dot worksheets the name of sheet that is master sheet dot activate then this workbook dot worksheets and then again name of that sheet dot cells first row and first column dot select so this is the vba code that we have developed or i have developed in this tutorial that should add sheet for each country so let me minimize this window and here i will click on design mode so that i can come out of design mode now if i click this button let's see what happens so here we can see that all the sheets are added as per the list or name of countries given on master sheet so this is how we can develop vba code for such kind of requirement thank you for watching this tutorial if you like this please subscribe to the channel thank you